here's our little shower area and you can see I have a paper towel where just the last like probably two weeks it's just been dripping water really slowly up out of the corner there. So it's been leaking onto this. And down going down there. there. Yep. Okay. I believe it is actually leaking from here. Yeah. Let's put a time in our. So we had our uh, in our bathroom shower uh, a drip every time it rained, and we were trying to diagnose where it was coming from. We couldn't figure out if it was a rub rail or what. But um, this is kind of worth twofold for us because. We found also a much easier easier wiring pass than taking the bathroom apart when we got to run wire. So it's much easier to pop this out if I don't put it in too good this time. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so yeah. it was definitely leaking. You can see, I could see there was a kind of a crack in the caulking along the edge here, but you can definitely see that it's wet here. Wet and, and that's where the drip is coming from. So it's simple, we'll pop it out. We're going to re-bed the insert, pop it back in, screw it in, and I'll go clean up our bathroom shower area where the drip is coming through. We good. Just going to scrape all the old caulking off. Caulking off. I'll clean inside that hole too. Okay. You know, just mm -hmm. uh, do some uh, spray on here after. Winter is not really the time to do this, but when you have a leak, you got to address it. So. I always stress about leaks, and uh, Derek has to remind me that most boats get wet. <laughs> Or, you know, they have water coming in, the water goes to the bilge. Yeah, it's just trying to figure out where the water is coming from, where the leak is coming from. It could Wiping the inside in there? Yeah, get Blocking. crap out. Yeah. Get it as clean as we can, right? I almost wish we knew about this spot when we were installing our uh, yeah. Starlink. Well, now we know. Now we know. For any future electronics too that we do. Yeah. I'm so glad we figured out what was causing this leak because sometimes with a boat you just don't know what screw hole on the deck is causing the causing it. So oh, I'll clean this up after. All right, so we put our bead of bedding caulking in. And we just gotta get this in place without touching anything. <laughs> like so, and give it a squeeze. <laughs> so ideally we want it to squish out all the way around uh, once we have the screws in and then you go around with your nice razor and cut all the excess off after it dries. If you try and wipe it now, it'll make a mess. Especially we're sitting right around zero degrees right now. Not ideal conditions to do this, but when you got a leak, you got to fix it. Kind of tight quarters with my big gut. <laughs> my New Year's gut. <laughs> you don't have a New Year's gut. <laughs>